we go from bananas, uh, or for uh, my American friends out there, bananas, uh, bananas, uh, to another food group, which is breakfast cereal. Now, this one, this one is a keeper. Uh, I'm, I was never ever going to let you uh, lightly off here. You can yodel the Cheerios jingle. There is, <laughs> there is no way I'm not going to ask you to do that. Okay, well, first of all, do you remember the Cheerios jingle that was a yodel? I think it was probably the 70s. No, I, I don't, but that's why I'm prepared. I'm, I'm, I'm ready to be enlightened. Okay. <clears throat> so the idea was that it was, it was a, it was a little cutout of a, of a Cheerio figure, and it would, would um, the Cheerio uh, would, it was like a, 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 a mnemonic. Um, that little kids around the world loved um, loved to yodel, but I have to say I did it best. And here's how it goes: <clears throat> Cheery Oreos, toasted Oreos. Are you remembering this now? Cheery Oreos. Do it with me, Joe. You try. Okay. Cheery Oreos. <laughs> now the second part: toasted Oreos. Toasted Oreos. <laughs> See, you got it. I now this will be your fun fact too. I love it. In fact, in fact, uh, according to Seth's box, uh, you just made the intro reel. Yes, you did. Uh, <laughs> you will be immortalized on the next intro, uh, along probably with Seth Godin and Philip Kotler. So you're in good company. All right. Um, 